content digital imaging fundamentals sampling quantization application of digital image processing one picture is worth more than 10000 words that indicates if we express an image it will take lot of words to explain rather than to view an image image sampling and quantization here four figures are showing and in the top left hand side an analog image right hand side its corresponding intensities that is showing in a line in the image in the analog image when the image intensity is very high that is almost white that indicates very high intensity whereas the in between darkest pixel and the white pixel the different shades of gray that is showing low intensities and below the left hand side that straight line corresponding intensity are sampled means they are cutted into equal pieces and in the right hand side that cutted small pieces their corresponding levels are represented by quantization level next here a continuous image projection is showing means when we are viewing a image that is in 3d representation whereas when we are capturing that scene that is in the 2d form so that is taken in the form of sensors and that is projected to the film or any other sensing device so the first when it is captured the scene that 3d scene is captured in the 2d form and finally it is sampled and quantized now representing digital image the top view is showing a uh, letter d how the intensity are changing in the 2d view it is showing the outer border is dark inside the letter d is by white and in between there are different shades of gray so there are three layers are there or three parts are there in the image the letter d is the brightest pixel that is represented by one and the outside square border is represented by the dark border or dark pixel that is represented by zero and in between color are represented by 0.5 so this is showing how a image will be measured in terms of different shades now in the previous slide we have explained that a image will be represented in terms of different intensities and different quantization level now it is easier to understand the same image in terms of this matrix means if we consider the image in a 2d form that 3d original image is representing here in the 2d form by a matrix from 0 0 the top left corner to bottom right corner to if the size of the image is m into n then the lowest the left the rightmost corner coordinate is m minus n n minus 1 so total number of pixel is m into n m number of rows n number of columns and it is represented by a matrix now how this bits will be stored digitally in the storing device or how it will be represented each pixel is represented by l number of states where k indicates the number of bits representing to represent that pixel say k is equal to 2 then number of different levels will be 2 to the power 2 that is to 4 similarly if k is equal to 8 then l will be 256 therefore 256 shades will be there between darkest pixel 0 to brightest white pixel to 255 so total number of 
pixels is equal to if the number of rows and number of columns are m and n respectively so total number of pixels will be m into n and number of bits equal to number of different levels will be l and corresponding number of uh, the the number of bits requiring is equal to k so total number of bits required to store that particular image will be m into n into k if the image is squared that is true if m is equal to n then total number of bits to store the same scene will be n square n or m square n now here showing different number of bits and corresponding number of level of bits to represent a particular intensity level if n is equal to 32 k is equal to 1 then the image to represent will be 1024 bits if n is equal to 8129 and k is equal to 8 bit the same information the same image will be re requiring 5368709129 number of bits so number of bits will be high that indicates as we are increasing number of bits to represent particular intensity then image detail will be more and more number of bits is requiring to represent the same image now here how the number of bits is changing and how the image information is coming to our perception or in our sensory organ so there are four images are there in the top left side number of bits is 1 to 50 dpi and correspondingly 300 dpi 150 dpi and 72 dpi respectively so it is clear as a number of bits are requiring less image detailing is showing less that indicates number of bits as we are increasing detailing information of the image is more and vice versa but as the detailing is increasing we have to give some tool for this that is to we have to give more number of bits that is to storage is huge now dpi is dot per inch means how much information per inch we are giving means density that is the resolution so more resolution means more number of bits application of image processing computer as photography that is to photoshop space image processing medical image processing automatic character recognition fingerprint face recognition iris recognition remote sensing industrial application and so on now these are the references and Thank you.